hello ho! You amazing, beautiful people. Welcome back to another Villain Saga reaction video. Man, do you know what? Do you know what I find it really like kind of actually relieving? Well, in like, um, I don't remember if it was my last reaction or the reaction before, but I said, like, I felt like season one of Vinland Saga was missing something. And honestly, I was terrified of reading the comments in that video of people just saying, just people going at my throat, you know? I always try and when I do these reactions, just be honest, you know? And sometimes you, you, people aren't happy with that. Sometimes people are cool with it. But I, I will never stop just being honest and genuine. And saying something like that, I thought people were going to come at me. It's actually really refreshing to see a lot of people say the same thing. And I've seen a lot of comments where people say, like, they loved season one, but they felt that a little bit too. They felt like there was something missing. And then when they went into season two, just like me, it clicked. And I, I, it's nice that that is actually a feeling that most people have got. And, like, well, not, maybe not most people, but a few other people have got as well. And, I've, and a lot of people are saying, yeah, that's because they see season one as the prologue and season two is actually season one. And weirdly... I, I kind of get that. It does have that feeling because I liked season one a lot and I wouldn't change anything about season one. But honestly, I cannot explain it. It did feel like something was missing and I just feel like with season two, so far it's just been perfection from the first episode to now. I have loved it. I've loved it so heavily. I, I really do. I think the storytelling is fantastic. I think the new character introductions have been wonderful, like really good too. And I'm just so freaking excited to see season two unfold. I think it is just absolutely excellent. I really do. I am having a fantastic time watching this. And I'm just so excited to see where it goes. I have no clue. It's completely unpredictable as an anime. So, and it really is as well. <laughs> like, I have no clue where it's going. I could not even begin to predict it. Um, <clears throat> my only prediction is that at some point the farm is going to be in danger. But that just seems so obvious, right? I imagine everyone. So other than that, I, I got no idea. So let's just, let's just... Let's just go, go along with the flow, shall we? Make sure you like the video. Make sure you subscribe as well. Unblood Reactions are $1 on Patreon. Link's in the description. And let's jump into my first time every reaction to Vinland Saga Season 2, Episode 6. The last episode obviously centered around Canute's story and where Canute is now. And now I guess we're going back to the farm. Which is good, obviously. It filled in a lot of blanks. I wonder if there's symbolism there. Oh no, he scared away the bird, I see. It's just simple. Has some time passed? Wait, did they- was there not- was there a thing earlier? No, just episode 6, we need a horse. Thorfinn looks older here. Some time passed? These guys must be hard as nails. A random thing I want to say here as well. I've mentioned this before in a previous reaction, but I used to like, I you used to like, I used to like question the strength for some of like the previous warriors and think it was exaggerated, until I learned a bit more about history and and the actual strength of previous warriors. And one of the things that cemented it for me that like people could actually be way stronger than they even are now, is the uh, the British longbowmen. I didn't even know this, but if you dig up, like, people knew, people basically, when, like, archaeologists um, and historians would, like, discover remains of, um, of soldiers in battle, they would be able to identify the archers. I can't remember why, it's something to do with the bone structure, but basically, they had to, like, pull back, I had someone, someone who knows more about this or someone who wants to Google it, go for it, um, but basically, the archers were so damn strong that they had to pull back, like, hundreds of pounds of pressure on these bows, and were able to fire upwards of 500 meters at accurate range as well. Like, it was absolutely ridiculous. The strength required to pull back a bow like that is insane. And they would regularly do this in battle. So their bone structure is literally different in on their skeletons. Like, insane. Has <laughs> some time part. Thorfinn really looks different here. Einar looks pretty much the same. Einar is like a, a, a young person who looks like he's like 60. <laughs> Gee. 
these guys. うまだ。やっぱりうまいねと話になるね。材木運びの時は貸してくれたのに、なんで聖地作業には馬が もう一度あいつらに掛け合ってみるよ。無駄かもしんねえけど。しつけえな、お前らも。ダメなもんはダメなんだよ。いや、でも、パテールさんのオイル氏はもらってるんです。パテール?はあ、あの奴隷上がり
Calm down, Ana. Calm down, bro. That's a good start. That's a good start. Man, I really love this anime. This season is fucking fantastic. I don't even know why. Why is it, why is this season like this? Why is it so good? Nothing's really happening, but I'm loving it. Crazy. あの、えっと、おじいさん。スベルケルじゃ。さんをつけて呼べ。スベルケルさん。この石拾いはいつまで石がなくなるまでだ。俺、手が止まっとる。あ、すいません。いって。うん、よかろう。で、あの、スベルケルさん、馬を貸していただけるという話なんですが、馬を持ってこい。で、巻き割りが終わったら水汲みじゃ。急げよ。はい。がっつり足元見られたな。こんなんやってる暇ないのに。ていうかあのおじいさんこの家に一人で住んでんのかなさあ俺も初めて会った人だからな本当に貸してくれんのかないいように貸してくれんのかな俺たちなあ I've just realized um Leif Erikson still looking for Thorfinn Leif Erikson has been looking for Thorfinn his like most of his older life now for how long found him briefly lost him and now is looking for him i don't even think about it because i was just thinking what happens like like how I, my brain was going i wonder how much time's passed since the canoe cut and then and then how much like when ana arrived at the farm how much how long had thorfinn been there for i don't remember if it was explained and then i was thinking leif still looking for thorfinn what would he do if he actually found him <laughs> Also just realized I we're probably never gonna see Thorfinn's mother and sister again Which is a bit of a shame because I feel like they did a really good job at like Building the character of his sister. It would have been very cool to see her again But I wouldn't be surprised if we just never do or we never even go back to Iceland だとしてもそれが俺たち。だとしてもそれが当たり前だろう。俺たちはどれなんだから。旦那のどれだろう。お前らの身の上なんぞ知らんわ。これは契約じゃ。馬を貸す代わりにわしの家の雑用をやってもらう。馬を借りるときと返すときにじゃ。分かったな。Well, I guess if you guys want a horse, you don't have a choice. よし、次行ってみよう。よいしょ。いや、ダクシー。ゆかいゆかい。まさか本当に貸してくれるとは見通しない。いい人だ。I love horses, man. よいしょ。I pretty much grew up around them. My aunties and my sister both all had horses and they're just incredible creatures. Even even little old me, I did like horse riding, uh, cross country horse riding for like a year. Two years. Random little fact about me. Just saying, I did cross country horse riding for like a year to two years. I realize it makes me sound really posh. Please understand, that ain't the case. <laughs> okay? <laughs> it ain't the case at all. Alright? Just one year to know. Okay? I literally went to like a, a, like a horse riding school and I think I, the lessons were free. Um, because my sister has a horse that was at the stables and there was like, I don't know. 
but yeah it was like free um or knew the person that t my mum knew the person that taught me it was something along those lines um yeah just so you guys know <laughs> i don't ever want to be perceived as that i don't think i've ever come across like that so it'd be even funnier if a lot of you like don't worry luke we never thought that <laughs> Thorfinn's looking really different. Is it just his hair back? Look at Adar, man! Adar's looking different, but he's just looking different because he's fucking smiling. Nice work, guys. Well, nice work, horse. That is a good horse. Well done, horse. Sadly, I have a funny feeling the retainers are about to crash the party. And that's what I'm feeling. This is too easy, and Vinland Saga, if it's shown us anything, it's shown us ain't nothing easy in this anime. ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
この列やったら今日はもう上がろうや分かったあストップストップまた根っこだ切り株は抜いても深いとこの根は残ってるからな仕方ねえ今年は浅く掘り返そう無理して借り物の隙を壊したら大変だすごいなあの荒れ地がたった一日でほらあそこもあっちもあそこほら2台だ今年4台買い足して重量助は全部で10台だとさ半端な金持ちじゃねえぞ旦那はそんなに高いのか高いさ俺の村じゃ8家族で1台を共有してたお旦那のとこに1台あってよかったよ奉公人たちは絶対貸してくんないもんな人の手と桑で同じように耕すのは大変なんだろうなそりゃあもうこいつと馬があるとないとじゃ大違いだよすごい発明だこれを作ったのは農夫に違いない農夫の大変さをよく知ってる人じゃないとこうは作れないよ本当に野良仕事を知らないなトルフィー何でも新鮮まるででっかい赤ん坊みたいだぞハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ I was literally thinking to myself, how crazy is it that I'm preferring this episode where all our main characters are doing is farming to the last episode, which was telling us about Canute's reign? You know? I'm not even joking. Nothing has happened this episode other than some farming. And I have absolutely fucking loved it. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Like, this is the.、Uh, this is great. I, I, I would honestly be happy if all of season two was just them. Like, it turned into just them wandering around the farm and just having fun on this farm. You know? We can. Einar and this girl can have, like, some sort of romance blossoming. Thorfinn's, like, just, like, be, like, slowly becoming normal and getting comfortable. And everyone just having a good, happy farm time. Honestly, I'm fine with that, man. I don't think that's where it's gonna go. But is the writing so good, I wouldn't even be mad. <laughs> So it's not, it's not the same old man, by the way. Earlier I thought it was the same old man, it's a different old man. I think. I think. <laughs> Oh, snake. Snake. It may, be, it may be the same old man then. Because he mentioned, because Snake was hanging around before and he just said Snake was there. It probably is the same old man, actually. ハタケディシネルナラホンモジャ。大体その年で一人暮らしをすることじたい無茶なんだ。力仕事もできんだろう。いらんせはじゃ、なんとかなっとる。父さん、意地を張らんでくれ。ケティルよ。お前とわしは
heavy. I wonder if we'll ever see Thorfinn's daggers again. Yeah. っていうか、あの雰囲気でグーグー寝てたんか。どういう神経してんだ。寝相悪いな。うん。うん。ジジイ、飯作ってるだろ。一人で食おったってそうはいかねえぞ。起きよったか。うん。これもグラム。なんだ
ケティルのやつは年に2回バカにならん額の高納品を王に送っておるそれらを受け取る以上王にはケティルを守る義務があるのだ愚かなことだ平和お金で買うようなマネーを一回の農民に守りきれぬほどの土地を持つ必要がどこにあるフッ<笑>イヤリングからここまで何日かかると思ってんだ実際に農場を守ってんのは俺らだっつうの大きすぎる富は災いを呼ぶ無視かよ<笑>富を増やしては失うことを恐れ恐れを和らげるために金を使いまた稼ぐその虚しさにあのバカ息子は気づかんああやだやだジジイは説教くせったらおおお晴れたなピンビューティフォーさあって今日も警備に行ってくっかなもう来るなよこなきゃこないで寂しがるくせにとったとうせろ Kinda love Snake man Bro is, is great He's kinda funny He's got like, he just like takes everything as a bit of a joke He seems incredibly badass Snake got a whole vibe around him you know Snake seem, Snake seem pretty chill God, it's such a beautiful anime as well, isn't it? Look at, look at the scene. It's so good. Wait, what do you say? They have a what? Those two are weird. Yeah, they are. Wow, they got the Mitsuki and Aina's smug face is the best. でかい赤ちゃん。それやめてくれ。An incredible episode, man. This, I'm not even joking. This might have been my favorite episode of season two. How ridiculous is that? I've loved this. Beautiful OST as well. I don't know why it isn't letting us know how much time has passed. I'm guessing maybe we're just supposed to guess based on seasons. But the fact that they've both now got goatees <laughs> means more time has passed. Although, realistically, it would only take you about two weeks to grow that much beard hair. So. Two weeks has passed, <laughs> but in in anime and TV show world, a beard usually implies years have passed. Dachi no you go to Shinjiro yo. Dachi. Eh, uso. Nanda yo, sore. Tomo shiro. Eh, shiga. Fuck yeah, your friends. It's probably your only friend, Thorfinn. Yeah. Yes, nice. That's what I wanted. That's what I wanted to see. Time and time again, my hopes are gone. It's a really sad ending, isn't it? Really sad ending. It's literally just like from the mind of um, Thorfinn, really, when you think about it. I wonder if we're ever going to see um, Thorfinn train Einar. Like, if we're ever going to see Einar improve his combat ability. And, he, and Thorfinn maybe train him a little bit. What's wild is he just... It's just not needed, you know? I like I like speculating these kind of things. And I like wondering about these kind of things. And, and I like and I like thinking about it. But yeah, it's not needed at all for the anime. But I do I find it a bit curious. It's like, are we going to see that? Is there something that's going to happen later down the line where perhaps it would be needed? But yeah, it, I, I, I am super like curious about it all. Are we ever going to see that? Is Einar going to one time like need to learn something and will Thorfinn ever be comfortable enough to teach him because you'd think not right with everything that's gone on with Thorfinn you would imagine he's not going to feel comfortable teaching anyone how to fight and we don't even know what that would look like especially 
when you compare Season 2 Thorfinn with Season 1 Thorfinn. Which is funny because both of them would equally not want to train someone, but for completely different reasons. One of them now seeing what battle and war does to someone. The other one just being a crazy wild nut job who doesn't have the time to train anyone, doesn't want to give anyone that time. Thorfinn's character is just masterful. It is brilliant how it is done. It's like fantastic. I feel like season one, he's like, can be a bit more like just you know he's just driven by anger you know that the rage of his father's death just carried through for him and that was all that he focused on and season two you see the results of that anger the results of that pain honestly man it's nuts how i'm sitting here thinking this was my favorite episode of season two so far i, I do i loved this episode it was brilliantly done nicely written the story was very captivating and even though it almost feels like nothing happened I feel like loads of things happened. Even Thorfinn himself. I feel like I learned a lot today. I'm very curious. I'm very curious. Very curious to see where season two goes. Because we've still got a lot of episodes left. And I love that. Because I don't want it to be over just yet. Because I'm having a really good time watching it. Hmm. Well, that's it from me, my friends. I hope you all enjoyed this reaction. If you did, please like the video. Please subscribe for more. Have yourselves an awesome weekend. And yeah, I'll be live on Twitch tomorrow. You want to join me for that? Cool. And that's about it. As always, my friends, you right there will see me in the next video.